<laughs> Ladna shoves the frog in the hole. Oh, God. So, Fern, you are pressed into a cold body of water, <laughs> lightless, with a very faint current. Let's just keep, keep leaping forward. There's like a very, very faint bit of just kind of general atmospheric deep blue light. It feels almost like being at the bottom of the ocean looking up, but it's kind of a little bit everywhere to where you have no sense of what's up or down. Uh, you see shapes and shadows at your periphery, like there are large land masses or clusters of rock around you, but you're not entirely certain how close or how far they are. Damn. Fern, you all right in there? You're just on your own. Out in the middle of nowhere. I just roll on my back. We're going fishing. Yeah. Who knows? You start being tugged back. Oh. And you're being pulled back, pulled back. And the sense changes a little bit in the water. And it kind of has a, it's oddly like a, like a, like almost citrusy taste to it. And you kind of glance over and you see this, these two very faint blue lights that are just kind of drifting. Oh no, 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 no. Getting no. bigger yeah, and bigger in your yeah, direction. I'm gonna try to just, just go to the, to, to pull myself pull the, the yarn side. and just Keep try to frog start hands. frog hands. <laughs> Good old frog hands. <laughs> roll her in, roll her in, roll her in. And I'm using my back legs. You're kicking, you're kicking, you're, you're, the slack's coming faster, and you kind of start pulling totter and totter. The two blue lights get larger and larger and larger. You manage to catch up to the slack, and you pull and pull and pull before she comes out of it. Uh, what'd you see? Ribbit. 